Hello everyone and welcome to a Dark RP tutorial and today we are going to show you how to make a perfect gun shop. So first of all, of course, you're going to need to become a gun dealer. And the things you are going to need are a stacker tool so you can do stuff like this. And you're also going to make a, uh, need a precision tool. So, right there. So you can do stuff like this. And by the way, to do that, you need to right click. And first thing you're going to probably need to do is break the windows, but we're going to use those as like templates to make this perfect and precise. So, the first thing you're going to probably do whenever you're building is put on a, you know, building sign. So, boom. Building. Now no one's allowed to read you. So you go in here. When you're building, you're going to use these. These are like storefront thingies. These are like to guard off windows or doors. Because most people use them for doing this. But I think they're actually really useful when it comes to windows. Because that's where people tend to break in. So, like I said, you're going to need the precision tool, and you're going to right click until it stops. And that's why this is a template. Now, you're going to break the window like that. You're going to break it with something, whether it be, you know, a prop. Because props can be used for that. And then, you're going to grab the stacker tool. You're gonna put it to your right, and boom. You're gonna do the same thing over here. And for instance, if you don't have one of those things, I'm just gonna grab this. And that's all you need to do. And boom. Now, if I were you, like, if you are on a server and you feel like there's trolls on there, like, for instance, admin trolls, abusers, just weld it, just in case. Now, if you really want to be secure, like, you leave your shop a lot, I would, like, I'm, I've never tried this, but I would get the elevator tool. And turn that to 50. And turn the horizontal axis off. I think is how you would do it. And then... Yeah, it needs to go... Way up. So we're gonna actually go... A hundred on that. In fact, no. To be a little more safe, we're gonna go a hundred and two. So yeah, you'll just keep on experimenting with that. Like this. And then, I believe you'll just... Oh, uh, that was on... Uh, it needs to be straight so it's not going uh, like crooked. Look at it. Is that straight? That looks pretty straight to me. So yeah, you're gonna do that. Does it go all the way up? We want it to go all the way up, so. Here, I'm gonna turn up speed a little bit. Let's put it to 109. I know it's going to be overdue, like way over it, but it doesn't matter because the speed is big and that's all we need. Is speed. Does that open properly? So if you want to like close the shop, you do that. 
And that goes back down. So now if we try to go in, there's no possible win. I've never tried this. Like, I know there's elevator buttons. But, like, isn't someone just going to touch those? Like, I would hide this. Honestly, I'm going to see if I can hide it way the hell over here. Oh, I can't. I was totally going to say, that's going to be fun. Um, yeah, it looks like we're just going to use it. So, we'll use your notepad. And, yes, this could kill someone if you're getting raided and they finally get that open. Uh, that's going to kill them as soon as it crushes down on them. Yeah, that works. And it doesn't get the door stuck. So, yeah. It's a brand new thing for us. So, that's pretty cool. Now that we got a little thing there. Um, now, the inside. So, if you don't have the weapon system, if you don't know what I'm talking about. Alright, so here, let me drop a weapon and sell it for a price this is how I do it so you'll drop it push R plus you e, don't push E R plus E and then price it nine thousand dollar gun and this is because you need uh, here let me show you the add-on Actually, here, I'll just say it. It's the uh, weapons system. Look it up on the workshop. You can get it or look for servers for it. This is for if that server has that mod, so disclaimer. I'll also show you how to hand them out because you could do it the other way. You don't have to completely copy off of me. Like I said, this is only if you're like, lazy and you don't want to actually like do the half to counter thing. Because I know I should as well don't. So if you do that, all you're going to need is some shelves, so you're going to go there, and you're going to get some shelves, and these are like display, and display models, uh, I, don't, I, I honestly don't even understand. I don't know why you would need display models, just, they can look at the gun for real, and if they push E on it, you know, they buy it, there is no, hey, I'm gonna steal this, there is, you buy the gun, or you don't, so, now, you're going to, I'll be right back, I'm gonna put the guns on the shelves, and I'll be right back when I'm done with that, so, see you in a second, so, after you get the shelves stocked, so as you see, I got two of each gun right here on the shelves, uh, MP40s and all that. I got that, and I got some ammo, which I supply up front. You can't really price them. Well, at least I don't think so. Yeah, you can't. But you can take that, and then you can sell shotguns for very expensive amounts, because you can be a cheeky bastard, because shotguns have a lot of firepower. And yeah. And how I did it was the more, like, good the gun, like, for instance, here, I'm gonna stock this gun, I'll drop it, like, this, and then it would make two, since this thing has the fire rate of a bunch, I could make this $706,000. Because this is a very expensive gun. And also, this is just humongously freaking expensive. I would pay a lot for that. Well, anyways, in the back, this is where I would sell explosives. Explosives would go back here. So if someone said if they wanted, like, extra firepower, like a minigun, I would go back here, you know, show them the minigun, and, of course, it would have its price on it. 
So, for instance, this is a minigun, so I would put this at like 2 million five hundred sixty-two thousand dollars. Yeah, if they wanted a minigun, that's how much. Now, if this server is okay with crashing all the time, selling this, it just looks like a normal one. But I'm just going to put this at 20 million. Oh, wrong. So that would be 20. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. This would stay away from everyone. Whoever would get this, get their paws on this, well, they have access to crashing the server now. And I would just tie this on a slave back. But yeah, that's where this would go. You put that there. This, I'd like to put down behind the counter. And just to be safe, like, because you can still get robbed. And they can still do it. Just buy one of these. Because this gun's OP. Yeah, it's a really OP gun. Anyways, you'll buy that, and then... Yeah. And that's how you make a beautiful gun shop. Let's take an overview. The only thing that we got to make sure of... The last thing that we got to do... For our last part of our gun shop. Get rid of this. Give it a unique title. Like, for instance, Toto's Guns. Or BMD, which is Black Market Dealer, slash GD Shop. And you put that like down here. So it's not just at the top, people are actually gonna see it. They'll be walking by like, oh black market dealer, okay. Let's try it. Then they'll come in, you'll and this will be open and they'll be like, hey, can I have a gun? And you can say look around. They'll buy a gun, they'll ask for ammo probably. And yeah. And you probably just made a very good profit there. Okay, so let's do a good overview. Right there. You've got some good windows to make sure people can't just go, you know, walking themselves in like, okay. This has to be welded. I just remembered that. Make sure you weld your pipes. That broke on accident. That's probably normal. We'll just precision that back. Boom. Very bad boom, but boom. Yeah, I guess it's gonna be like that sometimes. Whatever. It's a gun shop. No one's not. No one's gonna get in there because of a little tiny crap break. Well, anyways, that's what it looks like. It looks good, and if you really want to be protected, like if you got some illegal stuff going on in there, uh, get your material, I'm not really good with this, I believe with materials you'll just, you know, grab a material like this, except you'll post it in the other side, except these for some reason, want to spawn in different, uh, it doesn't matter, Really, that's it. You even got the elevator door, which helps. And I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like. As I was saying, until I got interrupted, sorry. I had to restart that, uh, that outro. So if you could, please like, comment, subscribe, and uh, I don't know. I'll see you in the next video. Like I said, this is the gun shop beautiful okay and uh yeah so hope you enjoyed and bye